Hey, Dave Bainey, Infinity Surfboards, and we are in my RB Components adventure van. Get out of here! Nah, just kidding. Actually, come on inside. We're having coffee. Outdoor adventure is upon us, people. Couldn't, and we're outdoors right now. Matter of fact, indoors, outdoors. We have that indoor outdoor vibe going on, right? That's trending. But yeah, this is the van. 2016 Mercedes Benz Sprinter 4x4. 170 in length. You know what they say about a big van? They don't say anything, but they should because I have the big one. All right, got some cool tires. Open country RTs. RT stands for road terrain. That means I could go on the road and other terrain and it's gonna be quiet and it's gonna be awesome. We put this Backwoods Adventure bumper on and I like it. I think it looks real nice. Yep. And it enabled us to add some fog lights. It gets foggy here by the coastline. I'm a surfer, you know what I'm saying? And we got this winch. That is in case I do make some poor decisions and that it helps me get out of poor decisions, that winch. Very powerful, worn winch. And we got this little bumper screen. Terra Wagon made this, and RB Components made this thing look cool and look like carbon fiber. So thanks for that. Carbon fiber is awesome. I like carbon fiber. Venture down here, this is our water system. So we got 22 gallons of water under here. That's how you fill it in. And this is just kind of the, the gray water. So I hook up a hose, put it into my buddy's tent. The water goes right in there. Or you just go like this, and you know, we're somewhere, there's no one around, and just let, just let it drain a little bit, because you know, it's just a sink, we're not doing anything crazy. So it's just, you know, washing our hands and stuff, and it just pours out. So we got 22 gallons of water there. It's all on a pump, super efficient. And we got it lined, and it comes all the way out the back. So you can see right here, Goes out the back with this hose, quick connect. So after I'm surfing, riding, riding my bikes, whatever, I got a little screaming grom and I wanna hose them off. Boom! Right between the eyes. One question I get all the time is like, cause I always put boards on my roof. People are like, how do you get up there to put your boards on the roof? And to me it's simple. It's like, you know, I'm not tall enough to put them up there. So I obviously have to use a ladder. So here's my ladder right here, RB Components. I do recommend not carrying a coffee with Baileys in it as you scale the ladder. But come on up, let's see the roof. All right, we're on top of the roof. Roof is super important because you're always looking for extra space in your van. So a lot of people actually use this to hang out on. They'll have a platform up here. I don't hang up on here because I like to put back a couple beers and it's probably not that smart. But what is smart are these rack systems. I load all my race boards, surfboards on here, get them out of the van and free up space inside. And also this is where I house my whole solar system. So I'm running 200 watts of solar, custom rack, low profile, out of the wind and everything. And it runs my entire electric system, including that fan. Solar, solar, eco-friendly, off the grid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so when I started and I brought this van to RP Components, this was a metal box. You know, I just got the basic entry-level cargo van. So everything you see in here, RB Components did it. Um, I was able to go up to RB Components and sit down with them, plan out the floor plan, um, get some ideas of what I wanted and my needs in the van, and I think we pulled it off pretty good for what I wanted. And um, so you can see like up here, this is like living space. One is a lot of storage. So they have this storage shelf. One in like, you know, some luxuries, you know. I wanted to be able to sit here and cross my legs and act cool. So we went with the leather seats, the nice bucket seats. We got this uh, portable table, comes in and out. So many business deals have happened here already. No, they haven't, but a lot of beer drink has happened. Yep, last weekend in fact. So this comes in and out. These all rotate so you can have your little powwow. And obviously when you're driving, it all comes out and, and keeps this area wide open. Um, all these lights and this fan run off the solar system. And so I never have to worry about running out of power. I have extra batteries. 
um, the solar is hooked up to the alternator so it's charging while I drive so I could be off the grid charge all my like laptops cell phones all that stuff and not have to worry about a thing we got everything on switches you know so these these all have like um, dimmers on them super cool and clean got some under lighting you know when you're trying to it's late at night you're shuffling you're like I need to check insta where's my phone super well lit all these cabinets are aluminum so they're they're um, very lightweight and they they're custom fit by RB components to fit inside the van they're all on click snaps so stuff's not flying out when you get a little reckless off-road and yeah all this is custom paneled out by RB they insulated the van they soundproof the van so it's very quiet and efficient energy saving hot and cold just super bitching got this fan for for um, you know just getting the airflow going in here so when you're camping this goes in or out you open windows you get a really nice breeze believe it or not um, we went camping last week and it was actually cold and it's the summertime so that was pretty rad everything we got shade um, blinds for every single window in the van which is cool as well and then yeah you come back to our kitchen so it's really nice to be able to stand in your van you know you fully cook and it, you feel like you're in a real kitchen but just tons of storage we got a full-size sink this is a Dometic sink do your dishes everything that runs on a pump and I prefer to cook outside but um, certain times I'll cook in here make some coffee and it's just a real tight set package and when I when I first met with RB I told them I'm all the one amenity I need that I'm not gonna budge on you gotta make it in my budget is a fridge so I wanted a fridge to run all the time and so we went with this Norcold fridge it's a very efficient low power wattage pulling fridge and it runs off solar so it's on all the time and what that means is when I go surf I have these waiting for me and what those are I'm not gonna tell you but you could probably make a guess but gosh I love that I love my fridge yep so now when you get in the back half of the van this is where stuff um, is kind of hybrid right so this is the sleeping area these rails house a three panel bed when we're camping and underneath is all storage and garage storage we call it so right now obviously we're not camping I store my bed to the side and now I have this free flowing zone that I can put all my gear. I got my paddle boards, my surfboards, my foil boards, mountain bike, everything I need just at my disposal right out the back. And it keeps this area kind of, you know, more dirty and the living space cleaner, just having it separate that way. And just, you know, tons of storage. We got L track through the whole thing. So you can maneuver and put these bags and storage wherever you want. L track makes a ton of these accessories where you could actually have stuff hanging. I could attach stuff to the roof. You could even do like a bunk bed system. You could put a hammock in here, whatever you want. Um, it's just really key to have L track throughout the van because you never you never know when you're going to need a tie down spot. You know, like I put these racks right here to tie them down. I got this one to tie my bike, and it's super cool. And then we finished it off with the coin flooring, which is weatherproof, very durable, scratch resistant, all that stuff. So um, just everything is thoughtfully planned out um, with the guys at RB and that's one of the reasons that I went up there is just their accessibility and my, my ability to go up there and talk to them and like actually talk to the guys who are going to make the van. That was huge for me. So that's it. RB Adventure Van, Infinity Surfboards. Thanks for checking it out. Just for